Hello guys, so in today's video we will be going through the process of running a Python program in Notepad++. So let's get to it. Before we get started, if you have not subscribed to this channel, please take a second right now and click the subscribe button so that the next time I make a similar video, you will be notified. Okay, so let's get to our today's lesson. Like I mentioned, in today's lesson, we will be going through the process of running a Python program in Notepad++, and this is in Windows environment. So the first thing that I will do is go to desktop and create a folder where we will place our programs. Okay, so I will go to my desktop and I'm going to create a folder here and I'm going to call it CK Tutorials. Okay, and then the next thing now is to go to Notepad++. So just open Notepad++. And if you do not have Notepad++ installed, be sure to watch the previous video that I made where I walked you through the process of installing Notepad++ in Windows 11 environment. So in this video, we will just write a basic Hello World Python program. So let's get to it. So the first thing that you will need to do is go to File, Create New, and this is your window so i'm going to close this and this is basically where you will write your program so i'm going to basically write a function that prints out hello world in python so i will go i will do define and the function name will be hello world and i will print hello world okay and then i will call this function here so once you have your program written down the next step is to save it and i'm going to save it in the folder that we just created so that was in desktop ck tutorials and i'm going to name it hello world dot py so you must always name them as dot py so that it knows that this is a python program and here, for the type, you can search Python. Which is right here. Okay? And I'm going to click Save. So you can see now that Notepad++ color codes your code once you save it. Now, how do we run it? Okay? So if you try to run it from here, there's no direct option in Notepad++ to run it. So to run it, you will have to go to your command line interface, CLI. So what you have to do is search for CMD here, launch it, and you have to copy the directory where you have your program stored. So for me, I have them stored here in CK Tutorials. I'm going to click this copy and basically put them right here. Okay, so I will see it to that. And if you do DIR, you will see here that I have my Hello World Python program. So here, it seems like we did not save it properly. So let's go and correct that. So we will go to Notepad++ and try to save it properly. Okay, so this one, we put a comma instead of period. So I'm going to correct that. Save it. And when we come here and do dir again we should be able to see that file right here so this is the second file here so the next step is to run this program so how do we do that again let me list what is in my directory and here this is the file that we want to run so to, to run this program all you have to do is do python and the name of the file which is this one right here so i'm going to copy this and put it here okay so and then just enter okay so here you will see that we have a syntax error in our code. So let's go ahead and fix that. So to fix that, we'll go here and it seems that we put exclamation mark outside the quotation. So we need to bring that one in and save it. And then let's try running it again. Okay, so you see now our code is running. Okay, so it's the same thing if you, if you had errors in this file so let me introduce an error here 
and then try saving it and running it and see what it will do okay so you will see here it's complaining that there is a syntax error and it is telling you what the error is so we'll go ahead and correct that save it and run it basically that is the process of running a python program that you have written in notepad plus plus this may not be a popular editor but for college students there might be a requirement for you to use notepad plus plus or basically anybody out there who wants to use notepad plus plus as their editor and if you're running python programs that is how you run your python program in windows okay guys i hope that was helpful again if you have not subscribed to this channel please go ahead and click the subscribe button so that the next time i make a similar video you will be updated all right guys thank you very much bye bye